What is up my fellow gamers? In today's video, I'm showing you legit the best and fastest way to get almost 20,000 credits in, in literally just one commissions run. Like and sub for more amazing gaming content. So I don't know why no one's necessarily talking about this. I did have one person mention it in the comments, but really there's not too many people talking about this insanely broken way to get credits super duper fast. I mean, legit fast, and it doesn't cost you any of your stamina either. You wanna have your rank at the bottom as high as possible, the higher the better. Now, what you're gonna do is you wanna do team commissions. What team commissions does is it goes ahead and it buffs up your other two additional rewards. So when you're doing commissions, you're gonna see that you got three rewards. You got one main one, and that's gonna depend on what you chose at the bottom. So right now we are in credits. So no matter what rank or what monster we face, our first reward is always going to be credits. You have your 2X or your 5X. Now aside from that though, you're gonna have two random ones. So these could be anything. They could be world credits, XP, memory chips, so on and so forth. You'll see that when you do a team up, it goes ahead and it advances it. Before, we were only getting this like lower rarity XP cards. Now we're getting the highest rarity and then the same thing with the memory chips. You wanna look for a commission that has credits as the additional reward. So for the second and third one, and what it's gonna do is it's gonna bump it up to an even higher number. Now I went ahead and I just did a team commissions run where we were rank seven and it was five times and all three rewards were credits. So something like this right here, you'll see that we have world credits as our first main one and then our two additional ones are also credits. When you have one like this and it's five times, you're gonna do a team up. Now you personally aren't always gonna have one that's gonna pop up for you, but what you can still do is you can go over to the team commissions and just look for other people. Because believe it or not, I mean, there's a lot of people playing it and if you come on here and you just wait, not even that long, you're gonna see a lot of people will pop up. Something even like this is gonna yield you a lot of credits. We got credits as our main for five times, and then we also have an additional one for five times credits. So this alone, I mean, you'll see that we're getting roughly a thousand, a little over a thousand times five. So that's 5,000, and then we're gonna get another 5,000. So this one alone, and this is only a rank five, you're gonna get 10,000 credits just from this. Now let me show you what I was able to do. We got a rank seven, three rewards with all credits, and five times. We got almost 20,000 credits in just one team commission run. It was absolutely insane. Let me go ahead and throw this uh, video up real quick. So look at this. I recorded this on my tablet and that was the end results. We got stay, we got a rank seven. I mean, look at all those credits. That is an insane amount of credits, roughly almost 20,000. I think the calculation was like 18,700 and something. And that was just from one run, no energy. So team commissions, I think is by far the best way to get those credits fast. And this is like the best case scenario, right? The worst case scenario is, you do something like this, this rank five one, where the where you only have two of the rewards that are gonna be credits. Ideally, look for one that has three. The second way to get a lot of world credits, it's a lot more grindier, it really isn't fun. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna come to the cinema, basically grinding the movies over and over again until you have all the hero encounters. So you're gonna come over here, we're gonna do our ticket inspector, we're gonna choose a movie to watch, now, the way it works is at the top for each movie, you're gonna have this thing called chance encounter for these characters. Once you go ahead and you encounter all three of the characters for that specific movie, you're going to instantly get 20,000 credits. Now, the thing is, it's, it's grindy. You gotta come in here and you gotta keep doing it over and over and over again. You gotta do start challenge. And then if the hero doesn't pop up, you gotta back out. And then you gotta go back in and you know what I mean? It's back and forth over and over and over again. It's very grindy and you can do this for pretty much all the movies. Definitely think the team commissions is way better. It's a lot faster. It's a lot more fun and you have the potential to get more than 20,000 depending on your rank 
within a matter of, you know, what, a couple of minutes. You go through and you have a rank seven, a rank eight team commissions battle. You're getting 20,000 and you can do that three times per day. I think it's a lot better because you can only do this once. So like after you go ahead and you grind out these chance encounters and you get that 20,000, like that's it. You can't do this ever again. You're not gonna be able to come in here and constantly farm this up. This is just something that you can kind of do once, get the 20,000 and then that's it. This isn't a farming area. So you can't farm credits here, but there, this is like a, a decent way to at least get a huge rush of credits after you do the encounter with the heroes. The way the encounter with the heroes works is you're just gonna go ahead, choose whichever difficulty you wanna do, and you're gonna see the hero next to your character in the little cinematic before the actual mini game starts. So for like this movie right here, we already encountered Lily, so we have to do these other two characters. So like we would just go like Nightmare, we'll click Start Challenge, and then right here in the cinema, okay, so we got Terrible Tornado right next to us. So that's how you know you have a hero encounter. If you don't have a hero encounter like this, then you would just kind of go here and you would just uh, stop watching the movie, back out, and then restart it over and over again. Like I said, this is very grindy and it's not efficient because you can only do it once, whereas the team commissions, you can do the team commissions thing the rest of your time playing this game three times a day. You can roughly get 60,000 uh, credits per day, 100,000 if you have a higher rank, depends. And then one honorable mention that I also just wanted to go over is deployment. Deployment is kind of like your AFK rewards. You can go ahead and just change your character's rewards to the world credits. I mean, it's that simple. If you just go over here and then you have your reward, just choose either world credits or XP. Just do credits for all of your characters if you're hurting really, really bad for credits. It's just another way that you can go ahead and get these passively. That is it. I hope you guys and girls enjoyed the video. Stay happy, stay safe. I'll see you all later. Peace.